we're back here in the VIP room. And we are here with... Jim Amen. 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 That's right. Jim. Amen for stopping <laughs> in and visiting us. No, absolutely. Nice to be here. Nice to meet you, yeah. And so I hear you are the former Speaker of the House. Former Speaker of the House. Retired in January. So did you just get here tonight? Or have you been just mingling around? Just got here tonight, Gabby. Oh, I've been mingling around. I was on a panel earlier, and I'm very excited to see um, the amount of people here today. And yeah. uh, it was a good panel, good questions about the movie industry, and so far, so good. And I hear you have a lot to do with the film industry coming mm -hmm. into Connecticut. Yeah, we, uh, you know, a few years ago in 2005, and yeah. uh, I uh, brought in my commerce chair and my um, what we call regs review and my finance chair, and I said, guys, we're going in the movie business. Yeah. And they thought I was nuts. Yeah. So now, what are you up to these days? I'm running for governor, and yeah. uh, you know, one of the things I want to. That's right. Amen. Woo! Yeah. One of the things we want to do, yeah. 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 do is continue. They try to create those, uh, uh, you know, those new jobs in the film industry and building the industry, building, having the young people get involved in Votech schools, or building the sets, the plumbers, the electricians, and, uh, you know, and a lot of other things too. But right now we're running and uh, we're going to be the next governor of the state of Connecticut, no doubt about it. I like that. You've got my vote. Now, where did your idea, baby, oh, the film coming into Connecticut, you know, birth from? It was very, very it was kind of weird. Howard Baldwin, did, did, he was just uh, doing the movie Ray at the time. Yeah. He actually owned the um, Hartford Whalers. Cool. He actually met with me to talk about bringing the Whalers back to Connecticut. Sure. His wife was in the theater business out in California, and on the way out uh, after having, a, after having a lunch with each other, she mentioned to me about he was going to be he's filming this new movie, Ray, and I didn't even know he was in the movie business. And I remember her talking about tax credits. And then very shortly after that, I met uh, Kathy uh, Mariotti, um, who did Raging Bull and uh, a few other good movies. Yeah. And um, I was with her husband, Joe Gentile, that was thinking of buying a studio up, at, uh, up in the London area. And he, too, when he came and introduced himself, talked about tax credits. So I finally uh, talked to a couple of guys what is this tax credit? Find out that New York, um, Rhode Island, and um, Massachusetts, including Vancouver, were all giving out these tax credit incentives. Didn't realize that 30% of the movies I moved from Hollywood didn't know that. And I noticed between being in, in, Cal in Connecticut, having New York, uh, Rhode Island, and Massachusetts right around us, it would be very simple to just say we're going to have the best tax credits in the Northeast, right. and we will build an industry, and we've done that. So it has been successful. We're loving it. and. Uh, so far, so good. Now you get 93 movies later, and uh, we've had five that uh, three that were up for five Golden Globes. Wow! And one that was up for the Academy. We did get a Golden Golden Globe, but we didn't get the Academy Award. But next year. Yeah, right. and that's the thing. There's always next year, right, Jim? Oh, we, we hope so. Yes. We hope so. Well, Jim, amen. Thank you for stopping by. It was, it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. Real pleasure.